it's dark in here. So hey y'all, hey, hey friend, hey girl. Guess what? I'm back on your screen. So look, listen, I came to do this really quick intro. This is going to be a really, really quick video. It's going to be quick for y'all, but not quick for us. But we're about to replace our mailbox because the one we had was just raggedy. It was old. It was leaning. It was cock deuce. Okay. So we're about to change it because we got so many projects going on. I'm just going to do this real quick. Make this a short video. And yeah. So let's just head on right on outside. Okay. Dang. So yeah. I have to show y'all this. So we out here trying to put in our new mailbox, right? And the stupid people, I don't know who did it. Anyway, prior to the mailbox that we had, which is the two poles, see that post one is out already. But someone used a brick prior to the owners before us. And so when they put the new mailbox in, instead of them taking out the brick, they just dug on the side and put the two posts in there and left us with a nasty, nasty mess. And I'm sure there's regulations that we you know we can't move this it has to be right here so we gotta dig and dig and dig to get this brick out of here a hot mess okay this is how much boss lady did so far i just woke up i came out like what the you know what i'm saying so i just had to show y'all this okay so okay y'all we finally got it out we done dug and dug and dug and dug. Finally, got it out. Got it out. <sighs> yes, baby delivered it. I delivered a baby. Yes, it's a boy, it's as you can boy. tell. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh my God. Let me get the measuring tape and see how deep that is. Okay. Because by state law regulations, we have to have it a certain height. Yeah, we did it. Oh God. It's supposed to be 24 inches yeah, wide. and it's not. It's not 24 inches deep. Here. So what is it now? The hole is not 24 inches. I'm finna show you now. I'll turn it around. Okay. Put it at, where'd you say it is? Um, well, I guess if we put it like right here. 18? About 18 inches. Look like it. Okay. Put it on your side. My side is higher. No, that's 11. Yeah, yeah, my side you, is. No, but it should be 24 inches in the middle. Can we do that? Measure from that? So, yep, it's what? actually, it's 18. Yeah, look like it's about 18. Yeah. <sighs> in the middle. Hold the pole. I actually need you to, why don't you come on this way? See, I put the butt on there. Okay. Yeah, I need you right here. Okay. I need you to watch what I'm doing. Yes. When I clear this space in the middle, this uh -huh. pole will go in it. We should have put the pole in first. Mom. Yeah, I should have. But I did it. <laughs> Twist it left and right. See a twist? Mm -mm. You're good. Stay, stay where you are. Is it wet in there? No. Oh, so this show ain't moving no more. I can't turn it, I mean. Good. I feel like it ain't in the middle. It's gonna be in the middle of the day. Mm -hmm. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna use these. Okay. Temporarily. Mm -hmm. We're gonna put one here. Okay. We're gonna put one over there. Okay. We're gonna drive them in as much as we can. That's good. See that? But is that it? Yeah, it's straight now. Hey. Okay. And plumb, mm -hmm. brace it if necessary, mix remaining concrete with water and place it into the hole. Mix it in the bottom of the hole. Oh. We're supposed to mix it. This supposed to be wet. Damn. I well, told you. Well, they're going to water holes. What are we going to mix it with? Oh, we need to mix it? For real, for yeah, real? Yeah, you know, like stir it around a little you bit. You want me to get a stick? Hold on. Where I shovel at? Well, I think our shovels will do, don't you? You want it? What? You want the water? All right. You want to stir it? No, go ahead. Stir it. Uh-huh.
Oh shit. Why you gotta lean it towards you? I'm, I don't know what I'm doing. That's why you out there to tell me which way to go with it. So we got the quick right now. We have to go get another bag. Yeah, we need another bag. Fill it up and it should be good. Mm -hmm. We gotta hurry up though. Well, come on, let's go. Yeah, that's it. Selling in. Well, let's turn it around and see. I say let's move it around and get it evenly dispersed. Yeah, there you go. Okay, I understand. Okay. Can't help it. More water. Mm -hmm. That's good enough, well, you're gonna have to add a little bit more. Okay. Like, okay, stop the water. Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. All right. Now mix that in, and then you you got time to come check your post. Mix your water. Mix your pump too. You don't understand it? Now you understand? <laughs> I was just trying to... So, okay, y'all, we back outside. The post is now stiff, as you can see. And now we're ready to put the dirt back in and start applying the mailbox, y'all. Okay, y'all, we got it packed back up. We're going to wet it a little bit to get it compacted down a little bit to see if we need to add more dirt. And then we'll be ready. Um, we're not going to put this back on, the square that was around. I don't think. I got to find out. Got a little hole or something? <laughs> 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 you got a little hole with sun. <laughs> there we go. We straight put this post in. Let me show y'all how sturdy it is. It's sturdy. Like, I ain't get a chance to show y'all us taking it all the way out and digging it out, but y'all saw that, that big piece we pulled out, which we did a pretty good job. Oh. Okay, so raise it up in the back and slide forward. No, no, no. That, back there? Yeah, now slide forward. Honors? Aw, do the honors. <laughs> we got the base. Okay. Just put it on here. Uh -huh. Watch your feet. It's going to so be mud. Step in the mud. It's okay, we'll wash it off. Okay. It's got to fit up against the ground. <laughs> How's your post feel? How your post feel? Feel okay? Uh -huh. All the way down to the ground, 
Sound us. Number two. Uh, yeah, we want that front. facing out. Uh huh. Do what you want. Oh, I, I know that's what I said. Now, what? Oh, <laughs> shit. okay, y'all. We got a saw. Hold on. So, okay, y'all. We got about, I don't know, maybe about two inches. I think it's about two inches tall. Do I say inches? Yeah, I think it's about our post is like two inches, about two inches taller than we needed. So, we're gonna have to saw some of it off. So, I'm gonna have to. Right here, so if I put it right here, it'll stop right here. You see? You see my line? Yeah. Ooh! Yes! Watch this. What's gonna do with that guy? I'm gonna keep it and set my camera on it. <laughs> I know it. <laughs> what I do, baby? I'm a hoarder. Oh, hell yeah. Okay. Okay. I gotta get a battery. Okay, y'all. We cut it off. Now it's time to put the top post on. Did you get the cutter off? Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. I just had a moment. <laughs> Her. Perfect. So come give me love. All of your love. Won't you love me to the morning? That one went in like. That's a little freak. Uh oh. I know. It ain't go, it ain't no different, baby. I don't want you to hurt yourself. Well, I don't want you to hurt yourself either. <laughs> I won't. Is it either or either? Both. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad they did that so that that way the people that will be in this neighborhood will be long-term people, you know, and will know our neighbors. What did they do? They stay uh, uh, shut down rentals. Why did they do that? Because they're trying to keep the property, keep the area stable, mm. you know, without people running in and out. And, mm. You know, a lot of times you have some people who rent, you know, they uh, are not who they say they are, you mm -hmm. know, they destroy your property, they they move in, say they live by themselves and bring all their cousins and aunties, you know, yeah. and they wreck havoc in the neighborhood. This way, you know who you got, mm -hmm. people are responsible because it's your property, mm -hmm. you know. And it's just a little safer, especially when you're trying to raise children. Mm -hmm. Well, I wish more kids would move in the neighborhood. Yeah. I do wish they on this side of the street. I know, right, where we can see? Yeah, I walk all like down there and right there. Yeah. Well, as we got two houses for sale. Hopefully young families, you know, will purchase them. Shit, I want me a drink now. Oh. Oh Lord, here we go. <laughs> you just have to be patient. That's all. Okay. Holly like Pop. Oh, oh, we got a short. Can you, yeah, get that in there and hold it like that? Righty tight, lefty loose. Yeah, uh huh. Fucking back? How the fuck do you do the back? What back? Didn't you drop them in the back too? Oh. Right. Yeah. Uh-huh. Right here. Yeah. 
Yeah, we screwed it down. Okay. Mm -hmm. We screwed it everywhere. Don't knock my cup off. So are we done? You got mail. You got mail. We did it. <laughs> we did it. 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 <laughs> it only took us 13 hours to ship. It wasn't no 13 hours. Because we had to let it set. So now we just got to get the bottom together. You want to settle down? I don't really care at this point. Okay, well, let's go get some bricks. Well, come on there. Let's go get well, some Well, baby, bricks. what about the dirt in the uh, on the ground? We're going to scrape it up, and uh, we're going to come out here tomorrow. We're going to dig it. I'm, first of all, tonight, I'm going to get it off of a thing and make a pile out here on the street. Tomorrow, we'll bring the trash can out and put it in there or something. Okay. And uh, we're going to take it and dump it over there on that site. So... Okay, y'all, we are finally done putting up the mailbox. It took us a total of, let me see, five hours to do it. We had to let the concrete set down in the ground. Y'all saw us digging it up a little bit. We had to let that set. So I think that was like another two hours. We were supposed to wait 24 hours, but we didn't. So we made the hole a little bigger than we originally had. So we had to put some grass seeds down, you know, so we can get the grass back or whatever. But anyway, that's this side. I hope y'all can see it. But it's so cute. So, so cute. We ain't got no mail. Baby, yes, we did that. So, y'all, that's it. And it's hot. So, that's how it looks from afar. Ain't that cute, y'all? Mm-hmm. We did that. I am so proud of that. So, yeah, y'all, that's it. That's all. That's all I have for this video. It was simply showing you all how we replaced our mailbox. I hate I wasn't recording when we finally got down to the bottom of concrete to remove the old concrete that they had in there. I wasn't recording, girl. We were so happy. We were screaming. We was hugging each other. So, we were so happy, y'all, because, you know, we, we do a lot of things around here by hand, okay? And we were just digging and digging. Then we ended up going back to Home Depot and buying a different shovel. It's like uh, the shovel part of it was like really long. And we were able to just push it down in there and kind of lift it up. And that's how we got it. So anyway, the mailbox that we have, it came from Menards. It was a hundred and mm, between a hundred. 120 120 i believe no more than that the one that we chose um we did have to go to home depot to get the post the post did not come with it it's a four by four uh i don't know because we end up having to cut it y'all saw us sew it off so i don't know but anyway if you do purchase this mailbox or any other you're going to have the measurements in there that you need so you can't go wrong so i guess the measurements does not matter but that is a the post we used was a four by four to go with that because that's what they recommended that we use for this mailbox so yeah another project down y'all gail said we gonna do this thing brick by brick by brick okay y'all heard this somebody with you so yeah anyway i ain't talking about nothing y'all i got to go in here and start another project so y'all i ain't talking about nothing i got other things to do really quick so i'll see y'all when i turn this camera back on so until next time until the next video bye bye Hey.